Now, um, once you've registered with the registration link of the person that invited you and you've downloaded the Royal Q app, you log into your Royal Q account. And now, the next thing we want to do now is you want to bind your Royal Q with your Binance. And um, I want to show you how you also um, how you fund and how you activate your account. So now you come to the home page here and you see this API binding to the top um, left. So just click on that API binding. And click on the API binding. So you see Binance unbound. So you click on the Binance and um, this page comes up. So you see your API key. They expect you to go and copy your API key and your secret key and bring it here. And they expect you to copy this API address to your Binance. So now leave this page and go to your Binance account. So uh, once you are in your Binance account, um, let's go to the home page on Binance. So this is the home page on Binance. Make sure your, your account is in Pro Light. So on this home page, just look to the top right. You see this way have more M O R E. So you click on more. What you want to locate is your API management. Just scroll down. You see API management. You can see it. So you click on that API management. So once you click on the API management, it is loading. It's loading. Aha. Uh -huh. So you scroll. Yeah, you can see create API key. So let's say we want to name our API key. Let's say we want to name it Royal Q. Then you click on create API. Then you get code to your from your email and your phone verification. Uh, just normal security measures in Binance. You copy your this thing for the phone verification. Then you go to your email. Yeah, you get your API key. You also copy that and go back to your Binance. Then you paste it there and you submit. So you can see API key created. So once you have your API key created, you can see now. So you have your API key. You can see your API key is already showing now. Very, very carefully. Just below this copy, you will see a small arrow below the copy. Click on that small arrow because you need your secret key. So once you click on the small arrow, just scroll up a bit. You can see you, have, you now have your API key and you have your what? Your secret key. So you copy the API key first. You go to your Royal queue. And you paste it where you have API key. You also go back to your Binance and you go and copy your secret key one after the other and you uh, paste it on your where you have the secret key. You understand? So now, um, the next thing is you copy this, um, okay, then you go back to your Binance. Now you want to enable the spot and margin trading. You want to do what? You want to enable the spot and margin what? Trading. So for you to enable the spot and margin trading, you come to you scroll up where you have your Royal Cunning, you click on the edit. So just enable only the spot and margin trading. You leave withdraw because the, the bot cannot withdraw your modding. So just you enable just spot and margin trading. So after you've done that. Then you go back and copy the where you have this copy. That's the API. Click on copy, copy successfully, and then you bring it to your Binance and come to below this red stuff. You see the restrict access to trusted IPs only. You click on that, then you paste that IP address that you copied from your this thing. You paste it here and you confirm. So once you confirm now, you now scroll up and you've also enabled your spot and margin. Then you go back to where you edit and you save. So once you save, they will also ask you to get a code from your phone. So you get code. So you copy the code and you paste it. So you can see edit API success. So once you now that have that edit API success, you now go back to your real queue, and then that is when you can now save. You agree to terms, then you now click on this send verification code for you to bind on your real queue, and a code has been sent to your email. So they will now send a code to your email. This time around from real queue, not from Binance.
Yeah, so the code is in. So you now copy that code. Copy the code and you take to the royal queue and you paste. Then you now bind. So this is the new binding. So for those of us that have done the binding before and didn't copy that um, API, please just go and do that copying of API now. So you've, you can see this one is bound now. So you've now successfully bound your um, Binance with your um, with your with your real queue. So the next thing now is for you to fund. Now for you to be sure that okay, for you, the next thing is for you to fund. To fund, you click on mine M I N E here. Then you click on assets. When you click on assets. Then you click on deposits. So this is your you copy your uh, real queue wallet address. You copy it and wherever you want to take it to and you send $120 to this place. You understand? For your one year subscription and for your full. So you copy this address, then you take it to wherever you want to send from. Then you send $120 to this place, TRC20. So once you've now sent um, $120 to this place, the next thing now is for you to do what is for you to activate your account. But before you activate your account, you come to this downward part and click on qualitative quantitative and you click on the quantitative it should show your usdt binance balance now that particular account i'm not having any usdt binance balance that's why you see it's zero whatever uh, amount you have in usdt in your binance it will show once it shows here then you know that your binding is very very accurate or it's very very correct so the next thing now is for you to now um is for you to activate your account so for you to do the activation um you come to your mine then you come up here this professional edition will still be this way then first you put it in blue you highlight it to move to blue so you 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 highlight the professional edition then where you have this renew you click on it what you will see aha uh -huh, you see something like this before this it will ask you a question will pop up you agree to the terms then a question will pop up you, you answer that question three questions choosing b c b then you submit then after you submit then this a page will come up and you see activate just beside cancel here send so because i've activated this account that's why you have renew so you click when you, once you click on that activate your account is successfully activated so once your account is successfully activated and the next thing now for you to do is for you to now go and um, place your trade you understand it's for you to place the trade now if you want to place the manual trade settings you get the um you get the the trade settings you want to use from your upline so now but if you want if you don't know anything about trading you just want to follow a pro trader and let him choose the trading um this thing for you just go to um cycle and um i recommend the jd winner that's the one we have many of us are following you click on jd winner and um okay it can be done yeah, i will send another video on that because this account is not yet um activated is not yet uh, connected so i'll send another video so so well what i've just done now is on how you bind your binance account how you uh, fund and how you activate so please um take notes thank you